Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Stalker, Call of Pripyat, Misery. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that it shows to join me today. As I try to understand what exactly is going on with the weather. Hmm. It might have bugged out. I think this sky is not meant to be a day sky. I... There, there was a... There wasn't an anomaly. Oh. Yeah, that's a life getting in. Um, there was an anomaly, or, an, uh, yeah, an anomaly, an emission in between episodes that I uh, dealt with. Okay, so yeah, this this weapon, this is our shotgun over here. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna bring a scope because the, the scope is actually not very good for, for fighting with. And uh, this thing has a iron sight, so it's good. It's good. The protected didn't because, well, I don't know. The, actually, I, I think I understand why the protected didn't have a, uh, an iron sight. And that is because the protector is meant to be a, um, a crowd control weapon. And not uh, a fighting weapon. It's not not supposed to be a war gun or a war weapon. It still does a tremendous amount of damage, but I don't know if it was it. Ma How do you do crowd control with bullets? <laughs> that's not crowd control. That's that's crowd killing. Huh. Uh, yeah, but I guess rubber bullets would work just the same. I don't know what is going on with the weather. I do know what I want to do. Uh, the guy does not know. Yes, but that's yeah. That's our mission right now. We're going to check out the other stingray this is very eerie this weather is extremely weird I don't know what is up with that There's terrible sounds all over the place and we have a seva suit uh, hopefully we'll not get killed or anything there does seem to be a fair amount of monsters coming this way so let's not deal so much with the monsters there we go Looks a little bit better for me. Our Seva suit is probably going to keep us safe in regards to um, psychic activities. Hopefully as well to this thing that's coming over here. I don't think it should do damage to me. But you never know with these things. And definitely there's a lot of A-life coming on. And uh, I say A-life, but uh, it, uh, enemies. Oh boy. Mm. Um, but um, NPCs also count as A-life. And uh, they're all joining. They're all joining. I'm trying to. I'm trying to figure out if I what I should do here. Uh, also, what what ammo do I have for this thing? Huh? Isn't the yellow one or the orange one? Wait a minute. Which one is it? So this one over here is FMJ, and this one full metal jacket, which means this one is the normal ones, right? Highest armor class uh, four, and this one is A3. And tissue damage medium, whereas this one is tissue damage medium. Yeah, this one is armor piercing. So we're going with the normal ones. That's fine by me. And I'm actually carrying around this weapon because we're probably going to use it to great extent. Uh, this episode might might go very badly, by the way. I I don't know what's going to happen. Oh, you had to, you had to, you had to, you had to. It's a nice br brand new brand new armor and all upgraded and stuff. And I'm already breaking stuff. Lovely, lovely. Okay, I'm not going to go artifact hunting. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm not going to go artifact hunting right now because uh, we might find some artifacts in Jupiter because that's where we are going. If if you didn't notice where what this means about the road to Jupiter and all that, we're going to um, a road to Pripyat, I should say. We're going to Jupiter plant again and basically to the same place as well, which is kind of weird. Um, but uh, I'm not really sure if if it's it's going to be better. The g I will say this weather makes the game run very very smooth on my side on your side it's still 30 frames per second with a occasional hang uh, the, uh, I can't I can't say that it doesn't have any hangs when I'm recording but it, they're they're way less common should be careful what I'm doing here cuz cuz um, cuz the uh, chimera was killed but the dogs below weren't, and I didn't kill them off camera. Uh, and I'm, I don't really want to deal with them, so let's not go though over there. Because their range is actually pretty serious. Uh, and my side protection, even though it, this is actually pretty serious side protection as well. Oh, I'm a little bit radioactive because I ate. Uh, that's that's basically it. Um, so yeah, it's, the side protection is not as... Uh, it's probably not going to be as great as it should be to deal with three psycho dogs or side dogs or whatever. Psycho dogs. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, I got the impression that I've heard that before, the Psycho Dog. Like a game studio or something, I don't know. 
but seems like we've dodged the worst of it. This early more the early hours in the morning are kind of tricky to see things on the ground and all that, but that's fine because we don't really need to see things on the ground. And let's start sneaking, uh, and uh, because you're just we're as a recon, so we should be capable of doing this fairly well. We're actually way faster in, at sneaking, I think, than uh, than other teams, than other um, scouts. Because look at this speed; this is proper fast. <laughs> okay, we have our first enemy. That's just. Uh, well, those are not cats. Those are pseudo dogs. There's a bunch of them coming. Well, there's a third one anyway. I don't want to deal with them. Stop making noises. I don't want to deal with them. Unfortunately, I think I'll have to because they're already coming. Hi. Okay, this is silenced. Three shots there, did the job. Really nice weapon, as you can tell. Really, really nice weapon. Is this the first time we're firing it? What are you, mister? You're a terrible, terrible, terrible monster. Bad monster. Okay. I don't I don't know the lingo in English to say bad things to a pet. I'm sorry. That's that was my intention there. Okay, that's not a pseudo giant over there. That's just a a giant made of metal. Which sounds scarier than it is, don't worry, it's all fine. It's also a little bit radioactive, which doesn't add to the, uh, to the, uh, safeness of how it sounds. But we might find some pseudo-giants down here. It's just someone I have to deal with, uh, pseudo-dogs, but, mm, we'll see. We'll see. I think the protector, I don't know if the protector, I need, I'll need to compare. I don't know if the protector does more damage than this weapon. Than the Saiga that we're using right now. This AK-47 converted... Okay, I don't know. Oh, the oh, that's a bloodsucker having to deal with with the. Uh, there's a lot of dead things over there. I kind of want to go check it out. Let's not, but let's check it out like this. Nice. Okay, four shots. Of course, it all depends on whether or not I get, I get a headshot or not. I'm not gonna get their stuff. Although the bloodsucker I would enjoy. Okay. Oh, it's not making noise? Is it because of my protection? It, it is making me see a little bit better. Okay, I wanna go there, but I'm gonna save. Just in case this is a, a bad idea. I really think it is a bad idea, but we'll see. Uh, I wanna see because I think those guys might be, uh... They might be people. And, uh... We might stash their stuff somewhere. Because we're going to get a lot of stuff when we go in there. I mean, not only is it just a rich place to, to explore. Also, can I get up there? I remember... Uh, yeah, I can. I can go through there. It's a dangerous thing. Uh, so we got... Just bloodsuckers, as I thought. Yeah. I don't know who messed with them, but... I mean, I guess we can tell. It's the bloodsuckers and the boars. But, yeah, the Bloodsuckers are not nearly as strong as they were in previous games. Well, I guess maybe they're not nearly as strong as I remember them being in previous games. Uh, where actually, I say uh, previous games, but it's the Misery mod that changes them a little bit. Bloodsuckers are actually quite quite easy to kill. Uh, okay, so let's sprint a little bit. Because we have quite a lot. Okay, let me actually look at my food. Food is good. Yeah, we're, we, I prepared for this. I, prepared, I did my job properly. Except for the bloodsucker that might be around here. And the bunch of zombies over there. I don't want to have to deal with them. Okay. Okay. Of course, there's more of them, but they're going to different, in the different direction. So, if I can just stay cool, get their stuff, and drop it somewhere in there, it's all going to be fine. I'm just getting their stuff because... Oh, did they change? Did they change the direction that they're going? No, they're going back. They're such weird guys. <laughs> okay. Oh, we got a, an artifact. Interesting. And Kevlar suits. Look at that! Look at us getting good stuff. Kevlar uh, plate, I guess, not plate, Kevlar suit. Okay. Let's 
keep going. That's just the sound of the of the zone. Let's go this way instead of getting in through there. That is our objective. What is that up there? Okay. It is our objective to go through there, but since we're going to actively and actually explore Jupiter properly today, let's do this thing properly. I got my headlamp. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, I'm getting nervous. Why am I getting nervous? Please stop getting nervous, girl. What are you, what's going on with you? Oh, freaking hell. Seriously. <laughs> I hate this place. Okay, this is radioactive. Uh, We're gonna need to go up there. I think we're safe over here. Let's look at what we have. Just unload all of this so we can drop it. Fine. Uh, what is that? That is a sparkler. Sparklers are okay. I can, I can, I can deal with that. I don't know if there's anything back here. Kind of want to see. But the, the we're. Well, this is really, really dangerous territory, guys. Really, really bad. We're gonna die a bunch. Just saying. Got a stash in here. Let's take that stash off and drop stuff in there. The mine. Yeah, that. That as well. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll get it on my way back. Uh, I can keep that one. It's not a problem. Uh, I got something else, though. Oh, yeah, this. Okay. Let's go. Oh, this doesn't have a fence. I thought they did. I, I really thought he did. I thought, oh, this is a nice uh, hidey hole for us to just get into and not be attacked by chimeras. Like three of them at the same time. And also psych uh, poltergeists at the same time. I don't know what that is. Fireworks. It sounds like it. Okay, is that pick up pick up all? No. Pickable, I suppose. I don't know. Yeah, there's dogs around here. Oh a rope and some cigarettes. I'll go back and get it, uh, and 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 deposit it because I don't want the rope. The thing is actually quite heavy. And the cigarettes, eh? I can keep them. Okay, uh, put that in there. I think it might have. I might have picked up something else. Yeah, food. Uh, where's the cigarettes? Yeah, put put them in there. That's fine. Okay, okay, we're good. We're we're progressively getting what we can. Now, the noises do not help. I'm, I'm, I'm psyching myself up. I'm, I'm getting, I'm getting uh, scared because of my, my expectations here. I don't see any enemies, but that's the. Oh, we're right next to, right next to our objective. We need to go in there. Uh, but that's the problem. Is the fact that we don't see any enemies, and when they show up, oh, we do see them. Okay, there's nothing down here. But this thing is radioactive. I could go to the other side. I don't think we have ever we've ever visited the other side, did we? When we were here. Now, if they don't pull any enemy spawning shenanigans, we'll be okay. Oh, a stash. Really well hidden. We'll be okay from the back. You can hear them. You can hear them already. Yeah, there they are. So if we gain, like, a, a place above, not as in dying, but as in just being capable of shooting from above, that's gonna help. Also, I want to see what the, uh, what the quest marker is, because I don't know what that is and why we're going there. Okay, I see that. Okay, let's not go there right away. Let's see if there's anything for us up here. No, there's a door that doesn't open. Yeah, this is not as nice a place. And I think we can get on top of the roofs. If that happens, then I think our chances of survival might go up considerably. Oh. Investigate the delivery department of, of the Jupiter plant. 
Judging by the note in the laboratory workshop, the evacuation was supposed to have been carried out by the livery department. So you should check there as well. Yeah, over there. Was this where I needed to be? No, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. But yeah, we've already, I think, I don't know, maybe it points there because that's where we need to go first. But I think we got what we needed. And we didn't check over here, and it's a good thing I did. I did not because that made me check over here. I didn't, we didn't check over here before, that's what I mean. Um, you know, it's a good thing. Because now we did. Okay. I'm getting a little bit dizzy. Wanna get out. Maybe we were... No, there's definitely movement over there, and it's zombies. Okay, zombies are the least of our problems. Honestly, they are easy to kill. And we still haven't, haven't managed to get up on the roof. Go away, little plant. I think we'll be fine. Uh, this area tends to be... Perfectly safe. I'll go up. I think we've been here. We might still find, like, bodies of people that we killed. Mm. Is that a stash? It is! With porn in it! Okay, that's actually quite heavy, isn't it? Yeah, I'll take all of that. I'll take all of that. I could, I could put it over there, though. The rest of the stuff, I probably should, because we're going to need to run a lot. Um, so let's do that. Uh, unload. Oh, man. Uh, porn. Yeah, I don't need that. I don't need this. Uh, what else don't, don't I need? A lot of these things, I, I suppose, but... Okay, I, can I use that? Yeah. Spent batteries. They changed color? <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> uh, okay, and that went to... Fully charge, I suppose, my... I, I, yeah, that thing. Okay, we're good. I don't think I should have done that, but... Now, well, we have more batteries and they're pretty cheap. Uh, I just, it's just my stinginess as usual. Okay, the, the sun is rising. It's actually, it, it is eight, almost 8 a.m., so lovely, lovely time of the day. It is, a, well, it's not my favorite time of the day, to be honest, but it is a nice time of the day. And in, in misery, maybe it is a very good time. Maybe I should be more appreciative of dawn in this game. And also, where are we? Why didn't we come over here? Because I don't remember coming over here. There's more stuff that we're not reading. Let's do that. Uh, okay, I can pause the game like this. Interrogation techniques. Uh, yeah, we read this before. What about this? USS Journal. Here's your gear. Oh, that's the different thing. Uh, a note from Strelik. That's a different thing. A note to Ghost. Or maybe not from Strelik. Anyway. Notebook sheet. Uh, the following... So it, it, I don't know if that was what we picked up. Folder in the order. Or with the order. Excuse the hiccups. The documents mention evacuation of the... Production complex from the Jupiter plant into underground laboratories. This matter was supposed to have been discussed in the laboratory section. Yeah, that's where we need to go. Okay, so I don't know what we just picked up, but it doesn't matter because we're going to the laboratory section and, uh, oh, that's bad. Um, and, uh, we're getting the notes from there that we'll discuss. So this evacuation thing is actually, uh, to Pripyat. Uh, that, so basically, the evacuation plans, it's, it's, it's not as clear as, as I'm making it out to be. It is clear, but it's just, you know, we're kind of going through the motions more than anything. Yeah, we didn't come over there. That's why I didn't get the stash. Speaking of which, I need to remember that on our way out. Because our way out is going to be considerably easier than our way in. And, uh, yeah, we're already getting in, 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 in dangerous situations, by the way. This is... We're getting closer and closer. Mm. We were here before. I, I, I'm I, starting to see the... This happens all the time, but I'm starting to see more of the um, sort of vision blurs that happen. I really don't want to attack from here. Because we'll, we'll, we'll have plenty of, of line of sight from above. There's no zombies over there. That's why I wanted to kill them. Because they, they would get handsy on us. They would come this way and they would surprise us. Because they were pretty silent. Okay, let me also get out... Okay. No artifacts. Where are we going now? We're pretty close. Good. Good. I'm navigating it more or less well. And I'm actually kind of depriving you guys. If you've played this game before, uh, then I'm not depriving you of anything. But if, if you haven't, I'm, I know I'm depriving you guys of the very, very tense sensation that you get the first time you explore these things. Um, f I mean, I, I remember having that. 
And uh, if you want, if you if you want to let let yourself fall into that, you can. It's all fine, because it doesn't. The danger is still here. The danger is still here. That's zombies. It doesn't sound like zombies, does it? Should go over there. It's pistols, though. This is nowhere I should be. I. That's so weird. That's so weird if it is zombies. What is it? Who is it? Yeah, I wanted to go over there. Did we ever do that? Can, did we ever manage that? Hmm. And all of this because of a dog. I don't like how that thing moved. Because the dog saw me, even though I'm crouching. Well, I guess it's not that difficult, is it? I'm not going to take your stuff. I am going to be very careful here. Or try to, anyway. Because I don't know where these guys are. think they were there I think they're all in there okay <clears throat> Hi. Oh, this is that wasn't too bad. I think they killed each other. I think they killed each other. Okay. So I got a hit. Uh, my equipment is still in good condition. So let's just get their weapons. And I'm probably gonna leave them behind. Although this is this is good good money. I mean, this is a few thousands. And look where they were going. They were going straight at me. I think... I don't know what happened. But that's what I meant. That I am glad I, I killed the zombies. Because these guys can screw my day very, very fast. Okay, there's nothing over here. Let's go back. Uh, let's go back to the other stash. And these guys are all dead. They will spawn. Oh, the, yeah, that's right. These guys were the ones that were just going around the other place. I know, I know. It's all fine. Uh, okay. So we're safe, surprisingly enough. I don't think it's through here that we get the other... No. It's through here. Right? I'm getting... Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm getting very tired here with uh, all this equipment on my back. It's a good decision that I made not to uh, to carry it all with me. Oh, it, it, it isn't marked on the map. Oh, that's bad. Especially because I don't know where it is. <laughs> I think it is over there. I can find it on the way back. That is easy. Also, I think I can withstand this radiation. I keep forgetting that. Yeah, this is the way. Yeah, we're, we're there. Okay. Yeah, it's the... So it's easy because it's the... Um, it's the other side, right? Was it here? Oh, it is. Yeah. It's the other side of the bridge. So I can deal with that for sure. Oh, okay. Let's see if there's any ammo. Not that I need the ammo for the pistols, but at least for the shotgun, that, that'd be nice. And let's drop a lot of stuff in there. Because we don't need a lot of it. Okay. All of that goes in, and that's that. Yeah, we're getting a, carrying a little bit more than we were before. The weather is getting a little bit more high definition, I should say. I, th I, I really don't know what, what went on with the weather um, at the beginning of the episode, but we're good. It looked really crappy, the sky did. Um, but I think, I think we'll be okay. So yeah, easy to find, not a big deal. 
and uh, let's keep going because we're gonna kill some some monsters and get killed by some monsters as well so I saved back there because I know this is the dangerous bit I don't think I can get up on the roof from here are you guys kidding me I don't want I, I want to mm. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them let's see what happens so we have dogs in here oh did we ever get to the laboratory no we didn't oh because it's a different door they're firing I don't know what they're gonna do <laughs> that's weird that is so weird oh there it is okay the delivery department had information about losses during transportation of something referred to as item 62 according to the records the repair workshop has was charged with handling this matter you should check there yeah I should that's what I always meant to go. Unfortunately, we don't have time for the day. Except to kill... To kill these guys. That's good to do. There, there's more of them. I, sh I, sh I should really have different, different rounds of this. Because I have... Anyway, yeah, that's gonna be that for this episode. I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Stalker Colo Pripyat Misery. I really hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and leave a comment, like the video if you want to see the next episode come out sooner rather than later. But above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye bye.